We're fitting a coil helper kit to the rear suspension of this Toyota Fortuna. The customer tows the caravan. The weight over the tow ball pushes the rear end down, which causes spring sag. These airbags will solve that spring sag problem and level the vehicle simply by inflating the airbags. The airbag fits inside the coil spring. But first of all, we need to remove the coils. Partially detaching the shock absorbers and sway bar will allow access for the removal of the rear coil springs. The rubber upper spring isolator is removed from the coil spring. Using one of the upper protector cups supplied in the kit as a template, the rubber isolator is marked up using a white pen. A neat opening is cut out of the rubber isolator to allow a direct route for the airline that will connect into the airbag. The upper spring seat requires a corresponding hole to be measured and drilled to also allow direct access for the airline. Squeezing and twisting the airbag slightly will make it easier to insert the airbag into the coil spring. The rubber isolator, upper protection cup and disc with the airline tube are pre-assembled. It is important to make a clean cut on the end of the airline to ensure an airtight fit into the push to connect fitting on the airbag. Cover the airline tubing with the outer protector casing. Reattaching the rubber isolator to the upper coil spring, the airline can be threaded through the previously drilled hole and the coil spring with airbag can be refitted into the vehicle's upper and lower coil spring seats. The shock absorbers and sway bar are reattached and tightened using a torque wrench. Left and right airline tubes are run towards the rear of the vehicle using zip ties to secure them in place. Once again the airlines are neatly trimmed before being connected into the push to connect fitting at the rear of the inflation valves. Using an air compressor the airbags are easily inflated. As the airbags inflate they lift the rear end of the vehicle solving that spring sag problem when towing a caravan. It's a good idea to check for air leaks on all connections using a spray bottle with soapy water. There we go guys, thanks for watching. Now remember, bag it with the best.